Good morning everybody. What is going on? Hope everyone has been safe, having a wonderful day. As you can see the sun is out and the weather is nice. There's no clouds in the sky so that means we're going fishing again. So me and mom going. We're gonna go diff explore a different spot today. I never went there before so I don't know if we're gonna catch anything over there. Hopefully you get some wallet maybe. And then we're gonna go check out that old fishing spot I used to go to a long time ago. Another one, you guys haven't seen that one yet also, right? So, let's begin the adventure. Alright guys, so, we're almost there. I get my mom with me here. Alright, so this is the bridge here. This is a nice bridge, nice scenery, is it? bridge and then um, let's see what the other side of the bridge looks like oh yeah that's look nice all right so we got a little bit more to go maybe a couple of miles more after this bridge here what look like we're there in a fishing spot already here right so uh, stay tuned we're gonna see when we get there I'm gonna show you the area, alright? Alright, so look at this here now. We just arrived here now. Beacon 42 going in this area here. Continue for half a mile. It's a little dark over the area here. never come here before don't know what I'm gonna see here tiger gonna eat us up uh, we'll see though looks like an interesting spot we check it out and then when we get there we're gonna show you guys all right so we just got to the fishing spot gonna take a look around this is a new area here I never come here before all right so I got a little boat ram there I see some more spots this side so this looks like a nice spot so where i can bring my boat and stuff right so uh i'm gonna show you guys here what the area looks like all right this is the boat ramp here don't know if we're gonna catch anything. I see something play in the water there. So uh, definitely have to bring the boat here one day. Oh, I see more fish playing. All right, so let's see. Mm-hmm. 
Get a crab there also. Right? We'll get a couple more. So, Mom said you want the crab. Mix that in with the curry. Alright, so we catch quite a bit there just now. So we're gonna make a couple more throws here and see how we catch and then we're gonna go to the other spot, alright? Make up the throw, I'm gonna take 
take a picture of him and then continue fishing. Alright, so maybe I'm gonna get lucky with this next pro here. I have the most fish and I was trying to throw the net out so far. Alright, alright. Net like you pull up. Net pull up. Literally the net pull. <laughs> That's why I'm a sheep head. Go release him back. here now so you cooler looking nice you get one crab oh the crab look <laughs> all right so I can put some eyes there keep them nice and cool So we're gonna rest the area, have, have a snack, and then go back out there and see what we catch. All right. So we're exploring the area here. See, this is a little ramp thing here. Water is very shallow though. I'm gonna go around and see. Look, there's a trail here. Let's go explore. Be careful, I call him. little beach area here it's a nice 
has a nice little area here. Look like water a little deep here. Maybe I've got my control here and see. Catch a nice snook here. Alright, that's cool. How much we get there? Four mullet, one snook. Gonna release the snook. Look at this little guy here. Little shrimp. So imagine how the cat not I find sticking up all the fine fine stuff. So have an idea. I'm gonna keep a couple of them for bait with the hook, right? Because I uh, bring my hook also. Maybe I'm just gonna cast it out a little bit and see. So we're gonna go back to the um, boat um, truck, put in this, try back the ramp one more time. All right, so let's go. Big one. This is the biggest one we get so far, sheephead. So we're gonna make a couple more throws here, scope the area out, and then maybe move on to our next area, alright? Stay tuned. 
All right, so we get some more mullet. Now we're gonna leave this area, this boat ramp here. And we're gonna go to our next area, right? We're gonna go out this way. And there's another area, I think it's called Hall Over Canal or something. I see it on the map over there, right? So I'm gonna go check it out. I don't know this area, so I'm exploring right now, right? So we did go to the first area. Now it's only, um, it's kind of about, let's see, now it's only 11.30, right? So we're going to go explore again. Get okay, mom right there, we don't, we don't have lunch and thing already. All right, so let's go. All right, so we had a new area here now. We're gonna make a couple of throws and see. Here. So we did on the dock here now. We need it. That's really good. Catch four from the last couple of throws there. Eh? We gotta put some ice on them. So we get four and then we get one crab. Careful with that crab. So this is probably the biggest one of the day. Bite you. You see? Okay, so the crab is bite me. Yeah, bleed. Throw it or what? He like bite. Put that paper towel. Bite hard? We yeah. just scratch our skin. So I'm gonna bite by crab today. I wonder if I can hold him. I can hold him. I <coughs> got um, Alright, 
so we'll just pack up the fish there and uh, we're gonna go to the other spot see you guys over there right all right guys so this is the last area we checked but we didn't catch anything um look like this is the intel coastline right so no mullets out here we, we mostly catch it on the outer coastline right so this is a nice area here also get some nice beaches right here and then this is the highway again i guess some guys over there doing some jet skiing all right it's a really nice area here so um I'm gonna try to do the drone footage, show you guys, and then I'm gonna head home after that, right? Hey, Kip. Breaking this crab here. There's a crab there. So we have Mr. Crab here. This one bite me. 
on my finger and give him a more crab there and then it's a really nice big mullet see these big ones all right so we're gonna bag them off as usual that's what we do and then um yeah so i said that a couple of curry there so my mom gonna cook the mullet tomorrow i'm not gonna get to video it but when i get home from work i'm gonna do the taste test for you because the mullet she's gonna cook mullet curry and um, i'm gonna be done cook right mullet rice with mullet curry with rice all right so uh, see you guys tomorrow for that It's the next day, literally in the next day in the afternoon time. So I went to work today, come home, and mom cooked the curry, right? So, really nice mullet curry here. And also, you can see the crab there also, right? And the mullet had egg, so I can't go wrong with that. Here's some mango here though, looking delicious there. Backyard, long time I didn't do a taste test in the backyard, so let's see here. I'm gonna try this fish egg first. So, um, my mom uh, clean and cooked two mullets, and one of them had egg inside. Really nice though. This is afternoon dinner there. Just had some dinner. Nice fish curry there. I'm gonna finish up my dinner now. Get some papaya here. And I get my mom over there. I'm gonna let me show you guys. Right before we end the video. Right? Go ahead. A nice papaya here. So, you guys are probably wondering what's happening to the papaya trees. As you can see, all the leaf is, is like gone from them. No, even the ones over there, right? And the thing that hurt the most, the, the one that hurt the most, is the mango tree because can see right there it almost burn out it didn't die but it almost burn out all the blossom from it gone so i'm never getting on mango this year it kind of sucks hopefully next year we can get some i'm gonna try to cover it up better next year all right all right guys so that's the end of the video quick taste test with you guys and a little backyard update once again thank you guys so much for watching my videos if you're not already subscribed please subscribe and I see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.